What's up guys, out here, welcome back to another video, and today, bringing you another video on Cut25, and I'm on another account, um, I should have recorded this before I did it, but I'm level 30 up there, um, the first part is from a couple of days ago, and I literally started the account brand new, this account didn't have any pre-order on it, didn't have any points, no pre-order packs, literally nothing, I started from zero, I started with the two free, um, players they gave us to upgrade, and the daily pack for 100 coins and the five free gold cards that you get at the very beginning uh, in the store for 100 coins. That's literally what I start this account with. Um, but yeah, I went through, I played so, some solo se se uh, seasons. That's it. I played eight games of there. I'll show you that in the video. I played one strand of solos and that's it. I did all the XP and I got to level 30. And so I'll, in this video, I go through all the packs, see who I pull, fill out the team and what it looks like. And then um, next episode will be me going through all the challenges and showing you how you can make even more coins. Because I think there's about 200k at least in the challenges that you could that you can benefit from. So I'm going to do that in the next episode. But join this one. Um, I just really wanted to show you guys that you don't need to spend money on the game. right? You either got to spend time or money. right? On my main account, I do both. I have plenty of time and I can spend some money on it not plenty of money but i can spend some money on it um so i kind of do both and uh my account reflects that you know i'm 83 on there 83 overall on there with over 4 million coins but on this account i have no money spent absolutely nothing not, not even pre order packs like i said um so just to show you that you can build a team you know with a handful of hours and just doing some solos and solo seasons um and then your team's gonna be ready to be online so that's why i wanted to prove in this video hope you guys enjoyed uh let's get right into it all right so here we are done a couple things um before i decided i wanted to like i said do uh the no money spent account but yeah we're a 6 9 overall we got the free uh story of the week uh player and our like five gold player pack that you get at the beginning so our team is basically at the beginning um i have my two uh, in case you missed it welcome pack and then the alumni ultimate alumni that just dropped uh just now a couple hours ago so i'll have that as well so i'll add these two players to the lineup or sorry this was even a player we have three thousand coins there but this is a player neighbors um and actually we're going to do the solos and we'll get them up to an 82 so he starts off at 80 um but you get this upgrade here for uh to an 81 and then you get one in the solos for up to an 82 so we'll add him to the lineup which would be really nice um orientation wise uh we can't really do fully um we still need to do one more challenge um, and play all these games. But we can't play a uh, solo battles game right now since they're out. So we can get our coins here, but we can't really get our varsity pack just yet. As for Season 1, um, we are Level 2. So acquire a pack. We'll do our daily for the day. Uh, we'll do these objectives. Um, maybe not win head-to-head -head game right now, um, but we'll do some of these in here. Um, we'll do. We'll get this done. We'll get the alumni done, and we'll get the conference stories done. Uh, hopefully, we can get some um, as we do the solos, um, and then we'll do those. But, um, yeah, right now, 3K coins. I'm just going to update, update the best lineup overall. Here we go, up to a 70 with uh, neighbors in there. Um, and, yeah, we're going to go, and we're going to do as many solo challenges as I can. First, I'm going to go do get a uh, offensive player or offensive playbook, the one I use, so I can get that. Um, and I think I'm going to do ultimate alumni – in case you missed it, conference stories, and then head into these as well. So I'll be back once I do uh, the Ultimate Alumni, in case you missed it, and conference stories. When I get those done, um, I'll come back, open up uh, open up the packs, update in the coins, and update what season level we are with all those. So yeah, um, I'll see you guys in just a second. Okay, so we are done with the grinding. Uh, I came back a couple days later. New shirt, all that, all that fun stuff, you know. Uh, but as you can see in the top right-hand corner, we're still at 70 overall. All I did was um, a couple cards I added through, like, the daily 100 coin packs um, that you get. I got a couple of golds out of those, and I put those in the lineup. Those are the only cards that I put in the lineup um, throughout the time just to get the Season 1 XP. Because, like I said, in the first episode, I think we were Level 2 just from, like, doing a couple dailies. You got past Level 1. I did literally everything in here um, besides these two. I haven't finished with these, but these xp wise will give me another 5k um and it only gets me up to this 2000 coins so technically if i were to finish those i would have 2000 more coins up there but i finished everything else um i had to go out and buy two conference players and a legend player and then i had to go buy um 
another alumni player and I had to go buy uh, to in case you missed a player. So um, I had to go out and buy them and I've sold them back. Then I bought the other two players then sold them back. And then so now these guys are on the market here, 12K and 10K. So we'll actually have about 45,000 coins after these two sell. This one was actually, uh, I will put this in there at the end, but actually one of the dailies actually pulled this 80 overall quarterback and sold it for 16K. So that's where that came from. Um, so this video, like I said, was just kind of to show you what you can do um, with zero, right? I didn't have any pre-orders. Um, I didn't uh, have uh, any glitches, anything like that. All I went from zero, level zero or level one to 30 only by doing objectives and if we come into challenges, because my next video is going to be about challenges and how you can make more coins. I haven't done the 101. I haven't done 201. I've done one of the offensive scheme, none of the defense. I haven't done legends yet. Um, I have done the ultimate alumni. Um, in case you missed it, I did the first set. Haven't done the second set yet. And conference stories, um, I haven't done, I think I've done one. So yeah, one challenge. So next episode, I'm going through all these, literally doing all these, just to show you like more players and coins you can get. You have over a hundred to, I would argue close to 200 K worth of cards and coins and all that stuff in those challenges alone. And I didn't even touch them, right? I did one little set. Okay. So even if you didn't want to do that, um, and you, if you are wondering how I did get all these, um, you know, stats done, offensive yards, rushing yards, passing yards, tackles, sacks, uh, interceptions. All I did was play solo seasons. And if you were, cool, one of our cards sold right there, 35K. Um, if you were to open these packs as you go, your team would be a lot better. Mine was a 70. I was using 70 overall in these, um, which made the line gr grind longer. But I've did all I did was the freshman um, solo seasons. I am 8-0. It should be really easy. Um, and then... I'm actually in the national championship. So once I play this one, I'll get more coins and uh, I think one or two packs. They just updated it, one or two packs uh, for that as well. So I could have waited to do that. But I wanted to show you guys, once I got to level 30, because level 30 has some pretty nice uh, stuff in it. Um, but yeah, like I said, 70 overall team. Uh, here's just to prove it, nothing in my binder. Haven't put any money. This is all, <laughs> all no money spent. Just what you can do um, and how you can build your team and play against these guys, you know, that have the 81, 82, 83 plus overall teams and still be all right. So let's get into the packs here. We got a couple packs that we're not too worried about, but like this 80 overall is nice. Five B&D fantasy packs, which I've been heat on my fancy, uh, my uh, main account. 284 uh, packs, some playbooks. Um, 77 plus pack, 82 overall, stadium pack, 83 overall, team pack, all that fun stuff, and all these things that you can open um, to build your team. So we're going to do it right here, see what our team looks like after this episode, and like I said, I'm going to go through and um, sell all our stuff. I'll just do it, I'll do it at the end of the video. Um, but yeah, what's, what I'm going to do is go sell all this stuff, um, our team stuff, this uniform pack, especially if we get something uh, that goes for a decent amount, give me like Oregon or something like that. Iowa away uh, might not be too much. Um, two strategy items, which actually go for a decent amount now that we kind of know what the strategy items are. So hopefully we can pull a good one. Linebacker is all right. And our other unstra uh, strategy item will be what? Quarterbacks? That could be okay. Um, we'll do a team playbook pack. Hopefully this is a you know a good playbook. Arizona is probably like the most. Um, and I'll go through that when we do... The Utes, Utah defense, maybe, maybe worth something. And our stadium pack, again, we're looking for the top big teams because those are the ones that go for the most. And again, I'm going to go through and sell all these. Wake Forest, okay, cool. I'm going to go through and I'll sell all those um, there. Okay, so we got this MVP season pack, which I don't believe is anything. I, do, I didn't want to open up anything until um, I was started recording. Maybe it is something here. Okay, so we do get players from this. Cool. I thought this was just... Um, that XP pack for Madden. So we get an 80 overall safety, or free safety there. An 80 left tackle, and a 80 free safety. Um, let's go zone, 80 speed. I do play more zone. I'm going to go, I'm going to go with the free safety. Oh, you get two of them. Cool. So I'll go the free safety and the left tackle. Cool, 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 cool. And then here it is. Okay, so I didn't, I didn't remember if you actually got, um players with that pack but you did so we got a free safety and a left tackle 80 overall on lock so when i go through these other packs here and the B and D packs i i won't choose those so let's do the 77 plus and see what we get 
And at the end, after ripping all these packs, we're going to go through and we're going to add and look at the team. Wow, we get an 80 from that. Cool. So the 80 or 77 plus, we got it right in. We'll take it. Another huge upgrade to the squad. Um, let's do the 80 overall, B and D. We know these are 80, so I'm just going to fly through and see what we get. We got a corner, a wide receiver. Wide receiver with 79 speed is okay. A corner with 80 and a center. Hmm. Let's take the center. We'll build up the offensive line there. 80 overall center. That will last us. Uh, you know, 80 overall center isn't too different from the 83, 84s in the game right now, to be honest. Um, I'm going to wait for the 84s because we already know what's in there. Um, and then I'll pick my, those guys based off the B and D players that we get throughout the rest of this. Um, because, right, if I pull, if I use the Singleton or the Howard in here and then we somehow pull an 84 or 85 running back, It'd be kind of dumb to have both of them. Um, so we'll wait to the end with that. We'll do the 82 B&D fantasy pack. So these should be all 82s. We're going to fly through it. Um, free safety, corner, and punter. We're not going to take the punter. Um, let's take the corner. 71 over, or 81 speed. This free safety is nice too. 81 zone, 82 speed. But let's take the corner. We'll take corner there. 82. Good little upgrade. And we'll see what the team is going to be uh, overall like at the end. Um, I think this 83 might be sellable it might be let's let's check because if that's the case we'll probably sell it for coins but again you can do what you want to do it is sellable Ooh, i know I, I have him on my main account and i literally just listed him for 90k so that's a good one left outside linebacker and corner so i'm actually not going to pick anything right now i'm going to back out and look these guys up um at the end of the video and i'm just going to take the take the card and put it up for the most um i can sell it for that way we get some coins um in there so cool let's get into the five b and d packs um let's see if we can get some uh pretty good pulls you can pull the regular like greens or the golds out of here okay we get an elite sorry nice we already do have a center that we just pulled but we could move one over to a different spot a right tackle there if we really need it another elite wide receiver nice we will take that and a gold. So, oh, not a gold. Cool. We'll take that. Defensive tackle and a wide receiver. So, 281s out of there on that first one. So, this is why I wanted to open these up uh, first before I open up the 84s because I want to see what type of lineup we're going to build out before we pick those. 79 there. 79, which wouldn't be the worst if we had to take them. Safety, we don't have a safety yet. We do have the free safety, but not that. So... We'll take this safety and wide receiver, 78 speed, 78 speed, left end. Let's do left end and the free safety there. The wide this oh, double, I didn't even realize, double uh, uh, Mizzou pack there. I didn't really want to take that slow of a receiver, 78. Quarterback, hey, we pulled him again. We could get a quarterback there if we wanted it. Hopefully, we can get a couple more elites. Left tackle, which I believe we just took. Actually, the same guy. So, cool. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. These could give you some pretty good pulls. Now, we did just take a 79 overall left end, but we're, of course, going to take the 84. And a free safety. So, we're going to take this. I'm pretty sure we already just picked him up. Was this not the same guy? It was. So, I can't take him. And honestly, I might roll with the quarterback. And that way, yeah, I mean, we kind of need him. We'll I liked him when we used him. So we'll take the quarterback here and that 84 left tackle. So sweet. We got an 84, really nice pull that's going to go out at left end here. Two more B&D packs of these. I love these packs. Like I said, they've been really, really nice on my main account. We already got a really good pull there. Let's see if we can keep it going. A left tackle, which wouldn't be worse. It wouldn't be bad if we have to take him. We can move him over to the right. Another left tackle. Again, we could just move him over to a different position. Free safety, wow, we're getting a lot of the same positions, same positions, but it's okay. Um, let's compare, because we could move one of these guys down to corner. We could move this 81 down to corner, 81 uh, zone, or the other guy, actually, he has 80 in both, the criteria for that, the threshold, I should say. So we'll take the free safety, um, and then this guy... He's a power and a pass protector. We'll take the power because I'm more of a runner. So we will take this left tackle and probably send him over to the right side, right tackle. 
but a couple no uh i forgot i can back out these packs anyway but here's the 84 pack we're gonna back it out there we go our last B D fantasy pack what else can we get come on let's add like 282 pluses give me that 81 kicker cool we could just set our kicker for now oh okay B and D Mika Fitzpatrick. He just came out today in the case you missed it promo 86. F uh, another free safety. We'll take it though. We will definitely take a big pull. I thought it was going to be a, an, and whoa, this guy goes for a lot. So we could right now, these two are the ones we're taking that Mika's pretty, pretty nice. 86. Come on. And we take that. So we're going to take our kicker. We'll be good for kicker for a while. This guy, I think, I actually pulled him on my main, I believe, and sold him for like 60-ish K, something like that, 50, 60 K. So we'll take that. We'll have kicker knocked out. And, of course, we're taking Mika Fitzpatrick, 86 overall. Just came out today. What a great pull. Great pull. So I'll just move those other free safeties um, over to um, corner, and we'll be chilling. Wow, what a great pull. Out of that, so we pulled an 84, we pulled an 83 there, we pulled an uh, 86 Mika that just came out, um, and I'll check how much he's going for. Let's just do best lineup and see what we're rocking with. What else do we need to pick up? Um, wide receiver, uh, running back. So we we'll probably will take Singleton because 80 he's in that pack there, so we'll have an upgrade at running back. Our offensive line looking all right. Uh, could use a tight end. Our, yeah, they already moved the free safeties down the corner, which isn't bad. Defensive line's looking great. Um, and linebackers. So we, we got no linebackers, um, really. And we need a, uh, a running back. And, yeah. So let's look what we got in this b, &B. I know we're going to take Singleton, a running back, but I don't remember the other ones in there. We know we got a quarterback and I think a, like a left end. But I couldn't remember the fourth. So let's see. Singleton... Howard Corner. Hmm. Maybe we go Singleton and then we go Kobe Bryant for now. We kind of already have our, our defense line locked in. We do kind of need a corner. We need to play the free safeties at backup. So I think what we're gonna do. We're gonna do singleton because we, we need a running back. Running, I would have got the 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 rushing stuff and the stats done way faster if I had singleton throughout this, but I wanted to show you guys what you guys can get through your packs. Um but yeah. Uh 72 overall running back, using him this whole time to grind these 30 levels has not been it. So um again, let me open up this 83 so we can look it up. And see who is there so we can see the better price. Left guard, 83, corner, and left outside linebacker. Left outside linebacker, honestly, I could take and just um, use in my team because, like I said, I don't have linebackers. But here's what the team looks like. A 77 overall for literally just grinding eight games and one set of solo challenges. And I still have 50K up there. And like I said, I'm going to go through next episode. I'm going to go through all of the challenges we have available, sell all of that, show you how many coins you can buy. I'm not even going to spin these coins up here. They're just going to sit here, and uh, I'm going to use just this team to go through those solo challenges, build up our um, build up our coin stack, so next video we can have one, a little shopping spree to upgrade the team, and yeah, just update, upgrade the team in general. So that is what the team looks like. Same seven overall, and I would be confident enough in my ability to go online with that team if I really wanted to, maybe like house rules and even the head-to-head. Uh, -head, I wouldn't do champs or gauntlet, of course, but head-to-head uh, -head with that team, you can get by because I'm in the lowest division. I haven't even touched online yet. Um, but yeah, let's go and just look at how much these 83s are, and then we'll end the video. Um, and yeah, so 83 left guard. Uh, we wanted to sell him. He is here. 80K is his lowest right there, and he has a couple more up. Yeah, so 80K for the left guard. We had a left outside linebacker who... It wasn't him, I believe. Maybe it was TCU guy. Let's see. Catalog. No, it was him from the Gamecocks. It was. So he's about... His medium price is about 70K, so... A little bit lower than the left guard. And then uh, it was a corner. Let's see how much he's on the market. If we can find him, yeah. Figured there'd be a lot of this. Yeah, these guys up. 
Um, he was... Which one? Hmm. I don't remember, but the 83s are looking like they're about 45 up to about 60k. So I'll probably take that left guard just to sell them. But again, if you if I were in your guys' shoes, I would probably take this this um, outside linebacker to use on your team, right? That's just another 3 year lineup. Your lineup probably goes up to a 78 or 79. Um, yeah, he was 82 speed. He's all right. Yeah, Leonard there. I would probably take him if I were you guys. Um, you didn't really need the coins right now. Take him out of your lineup. But I'm going to do the coins. So I'm going to take the left guard. I'm going to list him here for 77,000 coins. And once that sells, it'll be another 70K. We'll be over over, over 100. Um, and then, yeah, we'll go into the next episode. I'm going to finish all those solo challenges. Open up the packs that we get from there. Upgrade the team. And then probably go on a little shopping spree with the coins just to fill out the team. Um, and, yeah, my goal will be is at least to have an 80, 81 plus on um, just doing solo challenges and playing the CPU online for one season. I'm going to do one more game just to get this national championship done, get the coins, get the packs, do all the solos, and I'll be back um, in a couple days with the, the second part of this video, or second uh, episode of this No Money Spent, just to show you guys that you guys, you don't need to spend money on the game, just a little bit of time, and you guys can compete online and be all good. So hopefully you guys enjoy the video. I am out. Peace.